this week on the American Huntress. Ta-da! I'm in Alpine, Texas. Hornady presents the American Huntress. the week before Christmas and I'm in Alpine, Texas, home of Sol Ross University and the biggest mule deer in Audad there are in the state of Texas. I'm meeting up with Riley Garrett and her family, so don't go away. Let's see if Christmas comes early for Riley. After that eight hour car ride, the lodge was a welcome sight. Riley and her parents had gotten there the night before and we were all more than ready to get out hunting. Good morning. morning. How are you? Good. Hey, Heath. Howdy, howdy, Heath. How are you doing? Good. Did you sleep good last night? We slept like a lot. Yeah, got in pretty late, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we did too. Eight hours in a car, it's not fun. No. <laughs> <laughs> I did the same ride you did. Where's mom? She's in the kitchen. Okay, we'll go see. Well, howdy, howdy. Hey, Randall, how are you? Hey, Miss Linda. Welcome. Good to see you. The Cuerno Perdido Hunting Club is a lease I'm on, a couple of friends are on, Alan Stewart, Marshall Bergier, and we just come out here to have a good time, family lease, enjoy time with each other and the family. TK, hi, ooh, good, good. Did y'all get a good night's sleep? We did, we did fast. Yeah, <laughs> I know, I understand. Oh, this is the man. Henry Hi Henry, nice, nice to, meet to meet you. I have hunted all my life. I was raised on a ranch, we always hunted, and uh, I'm not an actual guide out here on these ranches, but I have a really good small group of guys that come out here, and they're just great to be around, so I end up guiding them just a little bit. Riley, uh, you are now officially an American Huntress. And um, PK? Yes, ma'am. You are as well. Thank you. And even more so once something's on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> it's semi official right now. <laughs> semi official right now. <laughs> but he? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't think with that, that cowboy hat's been uh, worn really well. I don't think we're going to get that out of his hands. <laughs> I don't know. Should I ask Randall or Henry what the plan is? Ask Henry. <laughs> Henry Randall's told me that this ranch is about 40,000 acres. Just a little bit less than wow. 40,000. Wow. Wow. So um, have the deer been moving? It's, it's been warm. At least it's been warm back home. It's, we just had a cold front come in and, and they've started moving. The rut's getting started. We're a few days into the rut now and everything's good. starting to move. So I think we've got a pretty good game plan for this morning to, to go. We got one we, we think we know where he is, but uh, we'll see. It's <laughs> it's hunting. <laughs> yeah, he was he yeah he was there. He was there. Yeah. Okay. Randall, um, with I'm just assuming that you're going to be guiding Riley. I will. Okay. I will. Okay. It's a it's a common deal for me. <laughs> I love it. Dads dads and their girls. I'm a daddy's girl. <laughs> Nothing, wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that at all. We really enjoy spending time with the kids. We've hunted Canada with them. We've hunted here in Texas for deer quite a bit. We've actually took a trip this summer to Africa where we spent three weeks and uh, that was fantastic getting to spend the time seeing the cultures over there. A new hunting experience as well as a new life experience. So enjoy taking them everywhere with us and plan on doing it every year. This sounds like it's going to be a great day. Have y'all eaten? We're done. Okay, we We're are in. we are too. So it looks like the vehicles are ready. Let's go. We're hunters ready, vehicles ready. Cameraman, are you ready? <laughs> <laughs> it's the big strong silent there type go. going back there. Well, let's let's grab our gear and get on out. Nice and secure 
Sir Henry? This place is really huge, and once we hit the trail, we immediately started glassing, looking for any sign of mule deer. Well, we were beginning to think that this hunt was a total bust, but you never know what's going to happen, and the day wasn't over yet. Don't go away, we'll be right back with the American Huntress. The American Huntress is brought to you by Hornady. Accurate, deadly, dependable. Krieghoff International. Verkunen, Boffin. Zeiss. We make it visible. Houston Safari Club. Get in the hunt. Diamond Blade. Performance forged in steel. Briley Manufacturing. A legacy of shooting innovation. Ravenware. Special garments for outdoor enthusiasts. Luminox, essential gear for every outdoorsman and sports enthusiast. And Ruger, arms maker for responsible citizens. This segment is brought to you by Hornady, accurate, deadly, dependable. We had seen trail cam pictures and we had heard all the stories about the great mule deer but we just weren't seeing them. Nothing was really going on until we saw the herd of Audad at the top of that mountain. Be still, nobody move. They're all up and down. Where? See them on the ridge line? Holy! Swinging down? They're all through there. All right, here you go. Get on the sticks. He's up there towards the top. Let me get the glasses on him again, okay? All right, there's a couple of years above him. He's towards the top. He's the biggest body and he's on the rock facing to the left. All right. Got him at 274 yards. You hit him. You hit him. Reload. Reload. Got him. <gasps> He's going over the ridge. Good shot. <laughs> He's hurt. He's hurt. Oh, that's a solid hit. Well, we were driving around a little Riley. We just ran across the group of all dead, and she made one incredible shot, and she got the all dead, but he was still on top of the mountain. What do you think about that? That was awesome. Have you ever shot an all dead before? No, the first one in the family. I'm breathing heavily because when we, we walked all the way from that truck, and we had to walk all the way up to there, why are we gonna do that? Because I shot my odd hat and it ran up very high. <sighs> Let's roll. The mountain is pretty steep up there, lots of loose rock, lots of cactus. Thank goodness it was cold, we didn't have to worry about rattlesnakes. It was a long hike up that mountain, but Riley, Randall, and Henry finally got to that odd dad. An hour later when we got there, I was so happy to see him. He was a monster. I mean, he was wide and the chaps on his legs were beautiful. He was just a beautiful ram all the way around. He was 270 yards up the mountain. We spotted him. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> and we shot a 257. Weatherby. Weatherby. And finished him off. And we made a heck of a climb. <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna get him down, that's your job. Don't go away, we'll be right back with more of the American Huntress. This segment is brought to you by Houston Safari Club. Get in the hunt. We were all tired when we got up there. 
<laughs> that was all right. <laughs> what do you say? That was, all right. that was cool, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Let's do it again tomorrow. <laughs> Seeing Riley put down that giant aw dad motivated everybody even more to get out and find a big muley the next morning. Wow, I can We're not looking for aw dads that go up and out and down. Mm -hmm. We're looking for muley that go out and yeah, out. Up. All right. Way out oh, and way, way yeah. Do <laughs> <laughs> you have a license to drive that? <laughs>
day got off to a great start when we spotted that herd of does. We knew a buck had to be close, and then all of a sudden, Randall spotted him. Can y'all see him? He's a real old deer. We got a nice good look at this buck and he was a great shooter. The buck was standing in some brush and all we could see was its face and ears. We moved a couple of times to get a clear shot, but the brush was just too thick. See what you're doing. Me and my dad were talking, and when I lost him, he kept um, navigating me to where he was. So, and he said, when he clears this brush, you're going to get a clear shot at him. The, the one with the double. All right. You see the edge of that? You see the one that does like this? Mm -hmm. You see the one to the left of it? Mm -hmm. All right. Go right above it. We're going to have to wait till he moves to get a shot him out. You see? Him? See where that branch dips? There! Right in the middle of the chest. You got him. He's, he's... Put another one in him on the left. See him? Yeah. Go? On the, yeah. Oh, wait, no. Wait, wait, wait. He's going to go down. He's going to go down right there. He's going to go down right there. Wait just a second. I can put another one in him. Look, go ahead. He's down. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Here you go. Yeah. Hey, oh, thanks. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Way to go, bud. Way to go. Nice, sir. <laughs> Way to go. Thank you. I can't wait to go see him. Me neither. Oh, my gosh. That was so much fun. It was action packed. <laughs> yeah, it was because we thought he was a goner. We did too. Yeah. yeah. I had a really great hunt. It was a successful hunt and I got two really nice trophies. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Look at the stickers on it. Finally. <laughs> He's heavy. He's got a thick neck too. He's an ancient deer. <laughs> oh! Look at his mass. Riley, this is a gorgeous deer. He's a heavy deer. So, um, you think Christmas came early? Christmas definitely came early. <laughs> Big odd at it, huh? Big muley. I am so proud. Oh, he is a beautiful deer. He's swollen. And he's so old. You did him a favor. He wouldn't have made it through this last next winter. Mm-mm. As cold as it's been? No way. Now, look at the mass. Look oh, at the tines and the forks. Oh. I'd like to thank the Garrett family for a great Christmas hunt out here in West Texas. Riley, way to go. Wonderful hunting. Thank and you. And you've got some great trophies. I'd say so. Y'all have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and thanks for watching The American Huntress.
Hi, I'm Linda Donahoe, and this is the president of the Houston Safari Club, Mr. Gene Newman. And we are out at the Shoot for the Troops Clay Shoot, which is a very special event every year to the Houston Safari Club. Gene, tell us a little bit about this event and what all is taking place today. Linda, this is an annual event for the Houston Safari Club. Uh, it's called Shoot for the Troops, and the proceeds generated from this event go to our uh, proud wounded warriors. And it's absolutely the best place to meet the best friends in the world. And don't forget Houston Safari Club's Worldwide Hunting and Fishing Expo coming up this January 11th, 12th, and 13th, 2013 at the Woodlands Waterway Marriott. And for more information, you can go to www.houstonsafariclub.org. Get in the hunt. The American Huntress is brought to you by Hornady. Accurate, deadly, dependable. Krieghoff International. Verkunen, Boffin. Zeiss. We make it visible. Houston Safari Club. Get in the hunt. Diamond Blade. Performance Forged in Steel. Briley Manufacturing. A legacy of shooting innovation. Ravenware. Special garments for outdoor enthusiasts. Luminox, essential gear for every outdoorsman and sports enthusiast. And Ruger, arms maker for responsible citizens. It's the week before Christmas and I'm in, uh, sorry. Really? Yeah. <laughs> An alarm like that, me, me, me. It's like kill it and put it out of its misery. <laughs> I was about to go boom.